You can be proud of that fight. I am, bro. I, for some reason, I, I don't feel like I lost. Just doesn't feel like that. Um, yeah, maybe maybe it just hasn't registered yet, but it, I've taken true L's before, and this doesn't feel like that. I mean, it was the points from the deduction from the tap on the back of the head. The tap on the back of the head. You can see which way I'm going, can't you? The tap. Thank you. Well, I mean, what's really good, dog? I'm, we're going to contest it. Um, I don't know how likely it is that the commission reverts on a decision that one of their refs made. You're shaking your head no. no I'll uh, tell you what I'm saying. <laughs> Listen, if you, if you want me to lie to you, I'll lie to you. I'm not going to lie to you because I'm a straight guy. Don't lie to me. Jack Reese is their most powerful referee. He's their biggest referee. Jack is a big man, and he's, and he's earned his stripes over the years. They're not gonna, they're not, I'm going to tell you now, they're not yeah. going to reverse a Jack decision. Okay. They're not going to that, do that's, that my, my, Simple as that. My gut tells me that, but you know what, bro? If I'm going to go down, I'm going to go down fighting mm -hmm. with a submission form that says, please, you shouldn't have deducted two points. Mm -hmm. Did you did you feel that did you feel that sometimes you were controlling it? You were making him miss wildly. These are boxing questions. We'll do YouTube next. Yeah. Did you feel you were controlling it at times? Um I, uh, my game plan kind of went out the window. That was that was the worst I performed out of every sparring session I've ever had, ever. Uh I mean you can hear my voice right now. Like I'm I'm sick, I'm nasally, I woke yeah. up sick, I've been sneezing all day, and i and I tried to ignore that. But it took uh, it took it took probably thirty to fifty percent out of me, and um, I don't know I, I I don't know if I was trying to like conserve energy because I thought I was uh, gonna die because of my like lungs or I don't know. But it's a draining week. You've worked flat out. You do more. Listen, I'm telling. You, I've been around thirty five years in this business. You two guys between you did more press commitments, did more time, gave more of your heart and soul than any fighters I've ever known. That's a tiring business to be in. Yeah, well, that's the trade-off. I mean, we do, we do, we're media guys, so we'll do more media and draw more eyeballs, and the boxing fight will be <laughs> sloppy and apparently dirty. Well, listen, it was earnest, and it was two guys that knew how to f knew, wanted to fight, knew how to fight, and got tired, and you never stopped trying. It was like sometimes you were moving in treacle, like you were knee-deep, but you were still trying. You were still trying to do things. Let me ask you this question, and I know you want to go out and do your stuff, do your thinking. Um, do you think you'd ever get a chance for a third fight? Because I've got strong opinions on that. Me and me and KSI. Yeah. I don't. I, I don't think he's gonna give me a third fight. I mean, that's like, my opinion. Yeah. I mean, he. If I were him, he came out on top, and unless there's a huge bag, which, I mean, maybe, but um, I I don't think he's gonna do that. I think it's a bit dangerous for him. I think he knows what happened tonight, and I don't know if he wants more. And I know you. I know you should be out. I should let you go now, and I'm dragging you and keeping your time. What about you? Where do you go from here, Logan? Ring boxing wise, not YouTube wise, boxing wise. It's a great question. Um, who knows? Yeah, I mean, I don't even know if we need to go back to the drawing board, man. Like, I, I, I be, I will beat KSI nine out of ten times. Nine out of ten times. I woke up today. You know what the first thing I did was? <laughs> <laughs> Coming down. I call something. Shannon. I go, yo, I'm sick. You can hear me. I'm nasal. Yeah, you, sound, sound, you sound totally different. Bro, I slept till 2 p.m. And, you know, I don't want to make excuses, but this is my excuse. Um, I think I think he he, he snagged a, a W tonight. And uh, who knows what it's going to mean for me boxing-wise. But I'll tell you what it's going to mean for me YouTube-wise. Absolutely nothing. Uh, I've been, I've been, I've taken, like I said, I've taken real L's before. This is not that. Can I just tell you something? I'm going to throw a bit of hot smoke up your ass, as we call it in the UK. We spoke to some people, right? It's not illegal. We're not going to film it. We spoke to some people in the crowd, and they said, we asked them, what is it about Logan Paul you like? What is it? And they said, he makes us believe you can achieve anything. This was like 14-year-old girls, 22-year-old men. I'm telling you, the people out there, they love you. They love you. Yeah, it's called being a maverick, bro. That's, that's the message that I'm trying to spread. And by the way, this is only going to perpetu perpetuate that and fuel that. Another loss? Yo, you think I'm done? No, I'm a, I'm gonna be around for a minute, making content, making people happy, making people believe they can do it. Well, when you're in London next, we'll get you on one of the shows on the BBC because it's been a pleasure and a delight covering you this week. You've Thank been you. fantastic. Thank I mean you. that. Thank you very much Thank for your brother. time, yeah, yeah. all week long.